I got a new machine and it's a joint and planar combination machine that I got used for just 100 euros. It was in pretty good condition. I just had to clean it up a little bit but everything works and I got the knives back from sharpening so I can put them back in and set them up. The knives were CNC sharpened so they are perfectly straight and very sharp. To set up the knives I have this homemade jig which is basically a dial indicator that I set up to zero and it helps me to set the knives at the right height. And this is just a quick time lapse of the whole process. I watched several tutorials on how to set up jointer knives and that made it a whole lot easier. I managed to set them about two hundredth of a millimeter above the outfit table and only one hundredth of a millimeter difference between the blades. Pretty good. And here the first test run in softwood. Both applications work very well. Now with sharp knives I get fairly decent results but also a huge mess on the floor and well everywhere because the the dust shroud that was supposed to come with this jointer is missing. And so the first thing I made for this machine is a dust shroud. And it will work together with my big dust collector. I took a close look at the dust shroud that is supposed to come with this machine and I based my design on it. It's basically very simple, but I wanted it to work for jointing and planing and it should be easy and quick to install. So I started by cutting out some pieces of plywood with a similar shape to the original dust shroud. The only challenge was to make the curved piece on the top. I made it by making multiple shallow passes with a table saw to make the plywood flexible. I also took care that the grain of the top ply run across the piece. It worked out quite good on the first try and I glued it in place. All the gaps were then closed with some glue and sawdust and sanded smooth. I then put some more pieces to the inside which helped guiding the sawdust towards the dust collection hose. I cut the right side piece of PVC pipe, put it into another piece of plywood and secured it from the inside with two screws. And then it was basically done and ready to use. For planing there is this screw on the side and it hooks into the fence. And the other side is secured by the jointer guard and it rests on two screws on the other side. And that holds them in place well enough. Now for jointing there are those two hooks and they hook onto a rod under the table and on the other side I have those two thingies that I can just flap out and it holds it in place. I finished it with a couple coats of yellow paint so it kind of matches the machine and next I want to build a new mobile base for it quite similar to the one I made for my bandsaw to bring it to about the height of my workbench but I will do this in my next week's video and then you can also see this thing in action <laughs> 